Should I create this video or not? I am confused because I created so many videos about the Olympus OM1 that sorry 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 OM Digital O1 where I said that you just should not buy that particular camera I created some differentiation video from this one to this one that to that and every single time I said that don't buy this and I plan to create another video where I should talk about the Olympus sorry 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 OM Digital OM1 versus the Fujifilm XS10 but I'm confused I'm not feeling okay to create this video because there is no reason to create this video one camera stand on a price point of 999 $1,000 criteria and another camera standing on a price point of $2,199 so is this any reason to create this video I'm not sure but because I plan to do it let's talk about this now if you see those two particular cameras you will be shocked on the Fujifilm XS10 we can shoot only up to 4k 30p and on the Olympus we can shoot up to 4k 60p big difference you can think so if you are a pro videographer and I think other than that there will be no problem of having a 30p because I don't find any problem shooting 1080p 60p or 1080p 30p maybe it is my flaws I don't know but I personally does not feel any difference between those two yes you can create some slow motion if you shoot 60p rather than 30p that's one benefit you can say but other than that both are quite okay both of these two camera have five axis image stabilization so there will be no problem the Olympus has weather sealing while the Fujifilm does not have any weather sealing in it so if you are saying that okay I need some rugged camera I will go for hiking or any humid places then Olympus will be an option but the problem is that Olympus has a bulkier body just kind of DSLR cameras where the Fujifilm XS10 has a little bit short lighter body which I actually prefer for myself and other thing is that both of these two cameras has a totally articul articulated screen and both of these two cameras can shoot 1080p up to 240fps so that's basically all between these two particular thing cameras in real so both of these two can deliver almost same thing except the 4k 60 and weather ceiling so why I should buy a camera with extra $1,000 that can deliver only these two if the Olympus have a full frame sensor then the $1,000 price tag extra price tag will be something but Fujifilm has a APS-C sensor and the Olympus has a micro for third sensor so the price point should be less than the Fujifilm but it is not so should you buy the Olympus sorry not Olympus the OM digital mark 1 or should you buy the Fujifilm XS10 if you really care about videography I will say that buy that if you have little bit extra money than that then go and buy the Sony Alpha 66000 instead of that I already created a dedicated video where I told you guys about the difference between the Sony 66000 and the Olympus ah damn it not Olympus OM1 
sorry, OM Digital OM1. Fuck you, warning pass. Just the numerical thing is just damn bad for Olympus. Damn bad. So the OM Digital OM1. I think you should choose the Fujifilm XS10 because it just flies at a perfect point, I can say. Just try it and let me know your valuable opinion about this particular rubbish talk. I will say because no one should choose to create a video between a $1,000 camera and a $2,000 camera for the same purpose. No one should do, but I did and it's kind of weird. So, that's all I have to say here. And goodbye guys. Have a nice day. See you on the next video. And let me know your valuable opinion about this particular bad topic. Bye.